5G will be a revolution instead of, uh, of an evolution. Uh, it will be a pity to interpret this as uh, another mobile network. It will be a new system. Uh, it has been designed for human and not, not human communication. So uh, I really think that some of the vertical market uh, will bring us some satisfaction. Um, we're looking seriously into the industry 4.0 market. Uh, we see companies very much interested in the in 5G revolution, in removing wiring, uh, if you think about a production plant and so on. Automotive will be very much promising. And I think also the smart city. We see also public administration are very much interesting about the possibility that 5G can open to them. We strongly believe that uh, cloud native will be a strong enabler for 5G deployment. Uh, first of all, because with cloud native we aim to uh, achieve a total decoupling from infrastructure, from hardware to the software. So we see cloud native as an environment which is app friendly and we will start treating uh, even network function as an app. You can imagine how this could make easier and faster the deployment of the network, the mapping of the network for different uh, use cases, so helping very much uh, to achieve a better time to market which has been not our main point of strength during past years. This decoupling of uh, infrastructure, hardware and software will definitely open up the market of vendors. Uh, first of all, you as operator will have the, the opportunity to use much broader set of, uh, let's say, hardware vendors because hardware in some sense will be commoditized. On the other side, you will have a lot of uh, company focusing on software only. So smaller company compared to the previous years and they will be able to enter uh, enter this market. Of course, this will bring some challenges because uh, you will you put together different software pieces, you will put together part of open source, maybe you will need uh, much uh, more support from integrator, like mm, let's say uh, some partners helping you to glue everything together to make it scalable, to make the small customization you will need in order to make it career grade. Edge computing is a good uh, use case for 5G. Um, if you succeed in moving uh, towards cloud native uh, infrastructure for 5G deployment, the cloud native infrastructure will be fitting perfectly also some edge computing uh, mapping infrastructure and business case. And edge computing will be hopefully a good opportunity for us. Uh, telco operator, big telco, will have the opportunity to leverage on a uh, good infrastructure on the field. So we can provide proximity, the control of access, the control of end-to-end -end, uh, performances. So hopefully this will allow us to play a, say a bigger role in getting closer to the customer and let's say to make new business opportunity with cloud providers. The, the main challenge, the first main challenge will be not to consider uh, 5G as another mobile network, another generation. We had 2G, 3G, 4G, 5G. If we promote this in terms of performance, in terms of brute force, uh, we will fail, simply because this model is sort of getting older. Uh, we need to think about uh, 5G as a platform, as an open platform, and if we propose the 5G as an open platform, uh, we will start attracting actors that will be very happy to have a powerful uh, way of accessing and, and reaching uh, final users. So again, platform instead of uh, mobile network is the key of success.